What's going on everybody? Uh, just want to show you what a green caterpillar infestation looks like. So, see all of these curled over leaves and all those little brown spots. That's a uh, waste, that's worm feces inside of the leaf. And all of these leaves curled over, or most of them, should be holding a caterpillar that's slowly eating the leaves and then eventually it makes this little cocoon and hibernates for a while and comes out as a moth most likely in this case or a butterfly so if I go ahead and pop this open you should see let me see if I can do this there you go you see your worm right there and that worm is eating, going to the bathroom, and ruining your plants. So if you see leaves curled over, I would smash them all, pick them off, and you can spray. Um, what I like to do usually um, is to periodically spray with a light solution of neem oil. But I haven't been uh, spraying this plant, obviously, because this was just a, a little experiment. Somebody bought me some old potatoes and I said, here, just throw them in this pot. And I've actually been kind of neglecting this pot. So, um, but right now I'm gonna strip all of this down, take off all of this old dead, and rotting worm habitat off of this plant so that it can start getting healthier again. And these worms, they, they kind of come in, in phases where you get a bunch at one time because the moths come and lay eggs at a certain period of time when the moon is full and stuff like that. And then you get a, get a whole set at one time and you gotta deal with them. If you deal with them early while they're small, that's a lot better. You get a lot less damage on your plants. But um, I'm going to clean this up. And look out for the next video. Because we're still growing. Growing food. Trying to teach people how to grow their food. Because it's not difficult. You know, you got little issues every now and then. But it's definitely not difficult. This plant is still going to survive. And it uh, still should make some potatoes. I'm not actually sure what type of potato this is because somebody gave them to me but um we'll see if they grow in this uh tropical climate well and make more potatoes all right peace